Dear student, in this topic we shall discuss osmoregulation in desert living animals. Animals living in hot, dry desert environments face the problems of excessive heat, evaporative water loss and absence of free fresh water availability. These animals have special adaptations for survival in harsh conditions. We shall take an example of kangaroo rat which is a small mammal living in some hottest and driest environments of deserts. It presents exemplary survival strategies in such an environment. They live in an environment which has no available drinking water and have only dry seeds to eat. They have a variety of physiological adaptations for osmoregulation. We shall discuss some of their adaptations. First, they are adapted to a nocturnal lifestyle. Yani ke din ke vakt baroz mein rehna aur sirf raat ke vakt bahir aana. Din ke vakt bahir rehne se evaporative water loss kam se kam ho jata hai. Aur baroz mein hot time ko guzar lena is se animal ke body ka jo temperature load hai that is reduced. It also reduces respiratory water loss. They also have a specialized nasal epithelium which has cooling properties and also has a counter current mechanism to absorb respiratory moisture. Is tarah se saans ke zariye jo bhi vapors bahe nikal rahe hote hain unko bhi ye reabsorb kar lete hain. They are also adapted to utilize metabolic water in place of water intake through drinking, which is not available. That is why body mein metabolism is water produced, and that is why water requirements are utilized. Karte. They also excrete highly concentrated urine so that the water loss through urine is minimized. They also produce essentially dry feces because they reabsorb most of the water from the feces in their rectum. All these adaptations ensure their survival in the desert. Dear students, now we shall discuss the adaptations of large desert mammals like camels. These large animals cannot hide themselves in burrows, so they face daylight sun in hot and dry deserts. They can go for long periods without drinking water. They have the ability to withstand extreme body dehydration. A camel can lose 40% of its body water but still survive. When they are deprived of drinking water, camels allow their body temperatures to rise. Ye temperature regulation ki ke liye evaporative cooling methods use nahi karte. Kyunke us method mein water zaya hota hai. Is liye no sweating, no evaporative cooling, balke let the body to raise its temperature. Yeh inki strategy. However, din ke waqt to aisa hota hai, lekin jab raat hoti hai, to cooler nights aa jati hai, deserts mein, to their body temperature drops. Body temperatures, ek dehydrated camel mein, jo ke thermoregulation nahi ka raha hota, yeh intahai zada vary karte hai. Raat ke waqt inki body ka temperature takhe ban 35 degree centigrade pe chala jata hai, aur din ke waqt, 41 degree centigrade tak rise bhi kar jata hai. This strategy is not possible in small 
rodents are small mammals because their temperature oscillations uh, are much more rapid than larger animals to wo to mukammal taur pe body unki dehydrated ya dry up ho jati hai agar small mammals is tarah ki koi strategy apnaye camels like many other desert animals produce dry faces and produce concentrated urine to minimize water loss when water is not available camels to urine produce karna hi band kar dete hain balki they can store urea in their body they have the capacity to tolerate not only dehydration but they can also tolerate high levels of urea in their body तो ये वो स्ट्रेटजीज हैं जिनकी मदद से कैमल्स डेजर्ट इन्वायरमेंट में सरवाइव करते हैं जब इनको पानी अवेलेबल होता है तो दे रिहाइड्रेट रिहाइड्रेट देयर बॉडीज बाय ड्रिंकिंग लार्ज अमाउंट ऑफ वाटर क्विकली एट ए सिंगल 